To keep seams from coming apart, secure the beginning and end of each seam. Here, we will explain how to tie off the end of the stitch with the overlock sewing machine. Sew about 3 to 4 centimetres of the thread chain at the beginning of the seams. Sew 2 to 3 stitches on the fabric. Lower the needle and raise the presser foot. Stretch the thread chain and lay it between the presser foot and the fabric from the left. Lower the presser foot and sew over the thread chain. Sew to the end of the seam and stop the needle. Raise the needle and press a foot. Turn the fabric over and lower the needles into the fabric. Lower the presser foot. Sew carefully over the previous stitching for about two to three centimeters without cutting them with the upper knife. Then remove the fabric and cut the thread. If you do not sew over the thread chain, be sure to leave enough thread chain at the beginning and end of a seam. So that it can be knotted. Or pulled through the stitches with a darning needle. When the seams cross over one another, the thread chain is automatically closed. To unpick the seams of the four or three thread overlock, cut the thread here with scissors and pull the needle thread. The stitches will come undone.